Hi, I'm Mark Haynes, Senior PGA Coach, and today in this video I've got a really quick video for you, and it's about one of the most common and most talked about subjects within the swing, the grip. And this is one, I want to look at one of the common problems that I tend to see when I'm coaching. So the common problem I tend to see with the grip is particularly to do with the wrist angles, and that a lot of people tend to have the wrist looking like mine are here. And the left wrist has got quite a lot of angle here and here, or sort of cupping, and the right wrist and arm look very straight like this. Now the problem is with this grip, it normally leads to people dragging the golf club like this, or basically not starting in the right sequence. So if you want to be able to have the right sequence in your golf swing, so moving the club head first, because that's the outside point of the swing, then we need to make sure we've got good wrist angles. So that what the process I see a lot of people going through to take the grip that have this problem, they tend to, they tend to get the left hand on the club, and then they often bring their left hand and left wrist in towards the middle of the body, like this, which can quite easily lead to this wrist getting that angle in there. And then when I put my right hand on, it just has to kind of match or, mimic, or sort of work around how the left one's been put on. So this gives you the wrong wrist angles at address and can lead to the shaft leaning in the wrong place as well. So what I suggest if you want to be able to change that quick and easy, then a slightly different process will help a lot. So what I recommend is if you have your left arm out fairly straight, so hanging straight, we're not kind of locked or anything, with my left wrist in line with my forearm here like you can see, then if I bring the club to my left hand, just keeping this all pretty much in line, nice and flat here, then if I keep my left arm in the same position, bring my right arm in, and it's much easier to get the wrist looking more in a neutral position, good solid position here, more how they want to be back at impact, than if you started doing it this way. So again, just a real quick, simple, easy tip for you there. If you're struggling with your wrist angles, give this one a go, and um, I hope it helps. Thanks for watching the video. Any questions, please follow us in, and I'd love to help you out. See you next time.